Go to the Tools panel, Photoshop, and select the Ellipse Tool or Rectangle, etc. Go up here and select Path, and then add it. Hold down the Shift to create a circle. Then go over here to the Horizontal Type Tool, and just type something. Now, as you hover over there, you can see the cursor changes. And I'm going to go with that one. That's what you want just on that line. You can click, and now you can add some text. Just something, whatever. To move it, Path Selection Tool. Just go to Path Selection Tool, and you can see there you've got that. You can just move it around. Now you'll see this point here. If I drag that towards that, it disappears, and then comes back again on the other side. Just cuts through there, and it pops over the other side. What you can also do is move it around. You can also drag inside, drag outside, drag inside. So you can see the text can be moved quickly that way. Now, if you don't want this, obviously, path to be shown, what you need to do is you can deselect everything. Just deselect everything, and you've just got then your text. Now, you can do exactly the same with any other path that you create as well. Just go over here to, say, the pen tool, and just click and add some. And again, make certain, press the escape, that it's a path, not shape. Just go with path, and again, go over here to horizontal type tool, and as you hover over there, you can see it changes again. And just type something. And obviously, because of the, uh, the way the type is, it's just going to crunch in there. But you can move it and space it if you wish to do that. But however, you can still, again, go to Pass Selection Tool and move it. So you just drag it like that, push it that way, or flip it over as well. Exactly the same. Flip it up, above, or below. Hope you found this of interest. Thank you much.